Hi everybody, it's me. Um, yeah, <clears throat> I'm sorry I've been off for a while. Uh, it's really, it's, it's harder to motivate myself than I thought, and it's something I need to work on. And, <clears throat> and yeah, but I felt like I should do this today. Yeah, it was a good day. A bunch of stuff has happened. Um, what happened? A couple nights ago, well, actually, both my parents' birthdays have been and gone, which was cool. Happy birthday to them. <clears throat> I watched the movie Tower Heist, which was hilarious and had, like, every actor I've ever I've ever known. Except for Martin Sheen, unfortunately. And I had Alan Alda in it, which is amazing, because I'm a super humongous MASH fanboy. Um... I had Matthew Broderick because, and that's great because Fer Ferris Bueller's Day Off is was is a favorite of mine. Um, <clears throat> what else did I have? It had um, had Eddie Murphy who's amazing, <coughs> and Ben Stiller who's he's all right. Ben Stiller stuff is actually pretty cool. <clears throat> um, we watched the SNL. We watched the SNL three hour, three and a half hour thing, which was. Disappointingly, did not have as mu many of the skits as as I could have hoped. I really wanted to see more cowbell in its entirety again, but it was actually good fun. They um they actually had a lot of fun with it. It was it wasn't it wasn't a bunch of skits, but what it was was still you know pretty fun and pretty pretty cool. Forty years of doing a show, wow. <laughs> that's that's an insane amount of time to do anything. I always kind of wonder sometimes about, like, in the entertainment business, when, when, especially with, like, YouTube, you know, I've yet to see a YouTuber actually retire from YouTube. And there might have been some yet, but, you know, so far the big names haven't really retired. They're still going strong, but, you know, sometimes you kind of stop and think that this isn't as timeless as we seem to think it is, and that's all right. You know, enjoy it while we have it, but, but it's interesting to think what's going to happen later in the years, you know. PewDiePie is just going to take his millions and just become a philanthropist or something. That'd be nice. <coughs> Heck, he might, he might even do this. Just, that seems like the kind of guy he is. I do not personally watch uh, PewDiePie stuff. Not that I have anything against him. It's just it's not, it doesn't interest me. But that's alright, you know. He's, he's, I have seen his videos and I used to watch them a lot. Or watch them some at the very least. And he's he's very he's a very very good person from what I very good person and you know deserves the respect and attention that he's gotten. <coughs> um, but yeah, <coughs> I'm not even gonna pretend that this is gonna be on any kind of a schedule. I'm gonna whenever I f can feel like vlogging, I'll vlog. I'll try and do it. Um, but having it kind of hanging over my head, I just kind of decide. Decided a bit ago that that's just not, that's just not a good thing to has to, to like go to sleep, all flipping guilty about. So I'm gonna try. I'm just not gonna feel guilty about it. I mean, I'd like to be able to do this a lot, a lot more consistently, but it, it it takes you know it takes a lot of effort for me to get up in the morning. Really, not necessarily, really actually, yeah, to like put, force myself to leave the comfort of my pillows. It's not because I'm depressed or anything, it's because I'm freaking lazy. So don't don't worry about that. It is pure, unadulterated laziness. <clears throat> and there's the pen. There we are. So, what do we have going on today in history? Today is Monday, the 16th. <clears throat> so, we'll just go with the 16th. <clears throat> um... That's kind of ironic. On the 16th of February, in 1959, which is President's Day, by the way, Fidel Castro is sworn in as Prime Minister of Cuba. Let's actually take a look at the month as we got it so far. That's today. Right there. There you are. That one right there. I think it's kind of I think it's kind of funny and ironic. Oh. I don't I don't even know what I'm doing. We're just kind of sitting here talking. <coughs> We're gonna have a snow day tomorrow. I'm really excited because my friends and I plan to go uh, go somewhere. Go sledding, luckily. Ooh.
A little bit of smudge here by the lens here. No, we're not too old to go sledding. Nobody's too old to go sledding. If anybody tells you you're too old to go sledding, that person has a wrong or understands that you have crippling arthritis. And even then, you should still go sledding. Because life is too short to not be a kid, yo. Heck, childhood is too short to not be a kid, don't you? But sledding is going to be exciting. It's going to be a whole lot of fun. The snow... Oh god, I didn't even talk about the, the friggin' polar blast we just had. I was actually on, it was on a Saturday, I was coming, my family, we were uh, just literally stepping outside of our ch of church. We just came, we just entered church, mass, and we stepped outside church, and within the five, five seconds after we stepped outside of church, it went from just sort of cold to, like, winter in, in, in like, Antarctica. Like, when you see the penguins huddling up to protect each other from the winds and the cold, that's what was happening. Um, everybody on the road was going five miles per hour except that one guy who was convinced that four-wheel drive gave him supervision, um, which it didn't. Uh, I didn't see him crash, but I feel like he probably did at some point. Um, yeah, it was just kind of a super stressful moment, especially for my mom and my sister, no, my dad and my sister, who, um, we're gonna go see the one acts at our local high school, and, um, so they were in a car together, and they're both kind of, they're both kind of, uh, they have a little bit of an anxiety that my mom and I don't have, so they were kind of freaking out about us and concerned for our safety, but it was, um, yeah, it was, uh, <sighs> entertaining to say the least, a little bit frustrating and concerning to say the most but it was it was okay you know we all we got home and and now it's snowing and it's gonna snow tomorrow and it's, it's great the school's canceled tomorrow which is also awesome i think that's probably gonna be it today everybody good luck have fun don't die